So I saw this report on how the Democrats are actually freaking out now about Biden's points, about his score, his polling. And it's like, dude, you're finally fucking paying attention to that? Like, Democrats, you're you, you finally fucking doing your job and paying attention to things? You're actually like, oh, what do what the people actually think? Huh, geez, I wonder. We're going to fuck them over anyways, but like, let's just see what they think for a second. And then, oh, oh, wow, they really don't like what we're doing. Huh. Well, I guess we'll just keep running anyways. We'll just make fun of Joe Biden's fucking age. And that, that'll win him over. Being... Being slightly funny about his own age. Making fun of his own age. Yeah, because, you know, Americans are all, like, concerned about his fucking age, so why not joke about it? Fucking Democrats are just as stupid as fucking Republicans. Neither neither party knows what the fuck they're doing. You're both fucking failures. You're both so fucking stupid, you're going to both run complete fucking losers and criminals as fucking presidents, as the primary. You guys are fucking idiots. Both parties. You both ought to fucking just drop out and we should all fucking create new parties because you're fucking, you're just nuts. You're stupid beyond belief. Like, how can anyone in America trust a Democrat or a Republican at this point? Like, we all seen you guys stole the fucking, uh, the primary from fucking Bernie Sanders. And then we see it with fucking, uh, the Republicans. They, they just give the fucking uh, primary to fucking Trump just because he says so. Just because he's like, oh, I'm, I'm the primary. I'm running, so I'm, I'm the one on top. Like, neither side listens to the fucking voters. And that's why both parties fucking suck terribly. Like, you need to just fucking change yourselves. Get, like, a brain in, on at least on one side. Either side would be nice. Like freaking A. I can't believe how stupid our government is. And then you start hearing about all the other governments in the world signing up for fucking right-wing nut jobs. And then you're like, it doesn't matter if you fucking leave this country and go somewhere else. <laughs> They're all run by fucking complete idiotic criminals that shouldn't be in charge of anything. All because everyone is so sick of capitalistic fucking idiots running their countries because it literally starves the people from even having a fucking society. It it destroys everything in their country with fucking capitalism. But oh no. Let's just say it's the fucking hero in fucking communism and socialism is the bad guy. Yet, communism and socialism, if done correctly in small portions, small areas, it is literally a lifesaver. It literally can help so many fucking people. And I'm sure that can be said about capitalism. Yet, there's so many fucking greedy motherfuckers in every fucking place in the world that even the nicest, kindest people that you think of that might not do something sketchy when it comes to money or for money, it possibly will happen because Greed is a big, horrible fucking issue in the world. And it is destroying everything that has been created by humans. Everything that we've done in history has been destroyed by greed or just plain stupid religious idiots. So, you know, that's how it goes.